Welcome back during a traffic stop in Monroe County, a Georgia man arrested for an illegal tag cover in possession of marijuana. Part of the drug possession charge included a candy bar. Ensley Nichols explains how THC products still count as marijuana under Georgia law. We see a lot more of these edibles, you know, kids and, and adults have gotten, you know, some pretty pretty bad results from eating these things. Monroe County Sheriff Brad Freeman is talking about products containing THC. It's the ingredient in marijuana that creates a high. According to a Monroe County Sheriff's report on November 26th, a deputy smelled marijuana in the car during a traffic stop. After searching the car, he found a baggie of marijuana in the driver's jacket pocket and a THC infused chocolate bar in the trunk. The, uh, the fact that he stated it was marijuana and it had THC in it, it was included in the charge of possession of marijuana. Everything was included included in one charge. The driver told the officer he got it while visiting California. Under Georgia law, THC is the equivalent of marijuana. Attorney Lars Anderson sees cases with people charged with possessing THC products under the Georgia Controlled Substance Law. They come from states where THC oil may in fact be legal or they're under the impression that THC oil uh, is legal. It's not legal in Georgia. According to state law, Governor Brian Kemp signed a new hemp law allowing for having 0.3% of THC in hemp products. Since the driver admitted the candy had THC in it, Freeman says officers didn't have to verify it was hemp or THC. But that's not always the case. It's certainly try other, other methods of investigative techniques to find out if it was marijuana, but ultimately you'd want lab results to prove that it was indeed marijuana given the new hemp law. The GBI crime lab tests only marijuana evidence that weighs one ounce or more, making it more difficult for prosecutors to prove if smaller products are marijuana based, even if it clearly says so. Just because it says it on the packaging that it'd be 0.03 THC, don't, don't always believe what, what? you read. In Monroe County, Inslee Nichols, 13 WMAZ News. Hemp and marijuana defined in state law look and smell the same, but they differ radically in THC content.